The experience of the hurricanes, Irma and Maria, changed my life, changed a lot of people's lives. The most traumatic experience of my entire life. Hearing the metal being ripped off of the shutters, hearing uh, the house next door crumbling. The revolution was not against the British, it was until the British came was like to mediate or whatever take control of things. I think Ronald Webster, he, he, was, he was a strong man. He was a critical element in the successful outcome of the Angola Revolution. I've learned over the years that the, the important role the arts can play in the building of a society. I live here for all my life. Like, I like the rave music in Angola, period. I would never move from here to go anywhere else to do anything with music but performing. Our job is to use wisdom of the past to say, look, have your technology, but hold on to things that the treasure. We need to develop on our love ethics, first of all, within the home. When people come to visit Anguilla, the first thing they say is the beaches, but they always say the people. If you haven't been exposed to the outside world, you will only think about Anguilla. After the hurricane, you find a lot of the fishermen in my neighborhood especially wasn't really doing it for money, they was doing it just to help. I think the true test of resilience is not just experiencing the storm and surviving it, it's how long that resilience is going to last to manifest in the end result you want of progress and amazing development. If I cry, I want a house. If I laugh, I want a house. So <laughs> wake up. I was on the computer. I was looking. I was looking at tickets and everything, you know. And then I looked at my neighbor and I looked at my community and I realized this is this is my home. That's what I feel about here in the Caribbean. Don't sell out. We as a people need to come together as one and help each other. Although these storms rip through it, although they, they ravaged our lives everything we knew, everything we know about. The test is which I know we're going to pass is how we rebuild, how we steer the inconceivable and once again rise to the occasion. We want you to understand us beyond the surface, to the heart, to the soul of things. So this is definitely, you know, it's not a paradise lost at all, it's a paradise discovered.